new owners are taking over the houses and the land of the people who had the misfortune to find themselves in the way of the Soviet army and the Azerbaijani Oman. Armenian Getashan has been turned into Azerbaijani Chaikand, and that's why no traces of the May tragedy are to remain. After the villages of Erkec, Manashid, and Buzluk, it is Verishen's turn. This is only the adjustment of fire. No flour for the fourth month. There is always someone who goes without bread. And the bread. We didn't have bread like this even during the Second World War. The war is lasting for a long time. They are firing at us with machine guns and cannons. They destroy everything. There is nothing left. Do you want to leave from here? No, no, never. Where should we go? Where? This is our land. Our graves are here. Our fathers lived here. We were born here. We and our children. Where shall we go? In the middle of August, the village was bombarded not only by cannons, but by tanks, armored cars, and howitzers. They were shelling with anti-aircraft rockets and from so-called crocodile helicopters, well known from Afghanistan. Perestroika is the continuation of the great changes founded by the October. The inhabitants felt the pooch with their own skin. During the night of the 20th of August, more than a hundred shells and Alazan rockets were fired at the village. Everybody was the storm. The Azerbaijanis are firing on Vereshen with large caliber guns. There may be many victims, but we cannot find out because of the firing. Can you hear this sound? The army is on the hills above the village. Nine armored cars and transporters. Two helicopters. And crocodiles. Make sure people stay calm and don't rush about. Make them wait in their cellars. Everything will be all right. We're relying on you.